still has that feeling of cold out there. And man, has it been cold. We are going on so many days in a row now. This is day number 11, where temperatures have not even breached 20 degrees. So it's just been absolutely bitterly cold now since Christmas. We're looking at a temperature right now of 7. This one is coming in from Rob Paracella. Rob is in Burbank. I have a temperature over here of 1 degree. This one from Kennedy Rodriguez in Manuka. Kennedy had really cold temperatures this morning. His wind chill now is right at 11 below. And we're looking at beautiful, sunny skies. I mean, that is a glorious, beautiful picture. However, there is nothing warm about it. And we look outside out over the city, and it's uh, sort of deceptive. It looks nice because it's so sunny, but that sunshine not really containing much in the way of warmth, if anything. What we're looking at and the uh, weather alerts right now is that we've lost our uh, wind chill advisory that was let go at 10 o'clock and that was allowed to expire. But what I've got still is a lot of wind chill advisory and warning activity from Virginia and the Carolinas stretching up to Maine. And there were warnings around South Florida. Now it's really just potential for a freeze continuing in here across parts of northern Florida. But wow, it has really been very active in the cold arena, bitterly cold temperatures. We've got still a winter storm warning for Port County reason for it. We still have the snow coming down there. It's been a factor and will continue likely to be one. We've got a temperature of eight right now. That's coming in from Midway, seven Waukegan, four McHenry, four Aurora, two DeKalb, and a temperature of about six at Joliet. Wind chills coming in at minus 16 Aurora, minus 10 Midway, minus 10 McHenry, minus 13 for DeKalb. I'm looking at currently a high that will likely get up to around 11. And you want to see the crazy thing, ladies? I see it. Here we go. So this is the, and I did not think about this when I was working on my forecast this morning. Yeah. This will be the 11th day of temperatures below 20 degrees, and it's going to be 11. And on the 12th day, 12. I have 12. I just kind of love the, the symmetry on that one. But um, either way, we lose any kind of record, thankfully. Uh, we'll tie the records up back in 1936 and 1895 because we will get just 12 days, not 13. 13 would have made a new record. But on the 13th day, Sunday, we hit 30. We do see a chance of some snow coming in. So we'll break the, we'll break the string on Sunday and stay in the 30s then for a good chunk of the next week. Good stuff. This is a yeah. record I'm fine with not breaking. Right. Yeah. But we tied it, and that's bad enough. Yeah, right. <laughs> Thanks, Megan. Okay.